Hey guys, welcome back. Um, I have yet another haul to share with you. Um, I made a few orders from Amazon. I have stuff coming tomorrow with these three boxes. Came today's Sunday, so these came Friday and yesterday. Like I've been, Jax has little um, sleep sacks but they're Velcro and they get like all bunched up like on his back and they just don't look comfortable whatsoever. He has two of them. And I'm like, I'm just going to get him one like Alex has to just zip. If you can hear me. But I cannot find any around here. So, it's on Amazon. And while I was looking, I decided to get um, another one for Alex too. Ow. The tape fell kind of... I decided to get another one for Alex also because she has like two okay anyway let's just get into it man I've just been rambling so much lately oh my gosh I'm dropping boxes sorry okay I've got bags falling behind me oh my gosh have like an epic Dollar Tree haul. Like, I went yesterday and spent $149. Yes, yeah, a Dollar Tree. And I went back today and spent like another uh, 30. I'm debating if I should do it like in one big giant haul or break it up into like four parts. I don't know. But anyway, in this first box, so this one is a three pack of sleep bags, size zero to three months. Let's see them. Like Alex is just now, she's two, and she's finally, she turned two on Valentine's Day. She's finally starting to, like, cover herself up, like, if she gets uncovered. Oh, no, don't wake up from your nap yet. Which is great, because these are, like, I use these mainly for, like, blankets, because she would always get uncovered, and I would go in and check on her, and make sure she was covered up, and then she'd move, I could do it again. So, yeah, so I got... Jacks, some new ones. These look huge. They're Carter size zero to three months. So this one is gray, with looks like lambs and owls maybe. Just animal faces. I'm not really sure. So there's that one that was in there. I need to get all these washed. Uh, the next one in here is just oh, gray and white stripes. It looks so huge. Gray and white stripes. Maybe it's just because he's so tiny. He just turned six weeks old two days ago, three days ago. And then there's this one. I thought I ordered him a newborn one. What did I do? Because this is zero to three months. Okay, this has little bears and like, how are supposed to be little neighborhoods on it? That's cute though. So that's the third one from that pack. This says, Amazing Baby Swaddle Sack, arms up sleeves with fold over mitten cuffs. So this is one that keeps their arms up by their face, so they can still like self-soothe, it doesn't pin their arms down. Which the ones he's been wearing, I've been keeping his arms out, because he like, moves his arms all over the place, he chews on his hands. So I don't know if he's going to like these, but this, if he doesn't like it, I can take the little sleeves off. I think these ones you're supposed to do. None of my kids like to have their arms pinned down. None of them did. They were not swaddling type babies. But he sleeps so much better. Like I let him, two nights ago he slept in just his pajamas and he woke up so many times during the night. So it's like, okay, last night I put him back in his little swaddle sack and he slept great. So, but this is a, this is medium. Three to six months, 14 to 21 pounds. So what the heck, none of them that I, I thought I got two of these though. Maybe there's another one in another box. I don't know. So these like form, look how cute, like shaped like an hourglass. And then here, the little hands can either stick out or you just fold these over so the hands don't come out and it just keeps their arms up. I'm not sure about these. I don't know. They all have great ratings. They say they're amazing for sleeping. Place baby in sack and zip up. Open mittens so baby can suck on fingers. Or fold over the mittens to cover their hands. 
replaces loose blankets for a safer sleep. Plus, it says if they roll, if they happen to roll over, which he doesn't, but if they happen to roll over, then their arms are already up to help them lift themselves. So yeah, this one's white with just little blue and gray elephants. So there's that one. That's it for that box. Um, what is this one? Yeah, so neither of those sizes are going to work. The one was 0 to 3, the other one was 3 to 6. So hopefully I have a newborn size in here somewhere. And I didn't mess up <laughs> when ordering. Who knows? I can't keep a thought straight. Okay, so this box has, I bought this for myself because lately he just wants to be held all the time and everyone's like, oh, just get one of those, you can still get things done. Which I don't know if it's going to make things worse because he's going to be like more spoiled because he's always in here. I don't know. But we're going to try it. It's a baby Catan baby carrier. It's just a little thing to wear him. Like I wear him at the grocery store so his little car seat carrier doesn't take up the whole, um, the whole cart. It says no wrapping because some of them you have to like wrap them certain ways. This one just slips on like a shirt. I got it in size small. I just got a black one because it was the cheapest one. A small, um, is for like someone that wears a size 6 to 8, who wears a jacket size 37 to 38. So it won't fit Jay, but. Carrier is meant to fit snugly. Age or weight of child is not a factor in sizing. If in between sizes, or if 5'2 or shorter size down. Yeah, I'm not 5'2, I'm 5'6. So yeah, we're going to try that out. Wish me luck that it works because some days with him and then the two-year-old. <laughs> the next in here is Alex's sleep sack. It's size 18 to 24 months. She turned two, but it goes from 35 to 40 inches or from 26 to 36 pounds. And she's just now 30 pounds. Replaces loose blankets for safer sleep. Yeah, so it's just, like I said, she already has two. The one of hers is super thick that I used in the winter, but now it's like, with the air conditioning on, her room gets kind of cool at night, but then during the day, when she's taking a nap, her room's kind of warm, so, I don't know, you can't win. I went ahead and got gray, because it's neutral, so it'll work for him. Oh my gosh, this looks huge, too. There's cardboard in there. This is a halo one. Did I say that? This is a halo sleep sack. I don't know. He's making noise down there when he's sleeping. Alex is asleep across the hall. Jay's at softball, so I'm just trying to get some things done while they're napping. So yeah, here's just a gray. And this is perfect because it's lighter weight. So this is perfect for now, like, her nap times when it's kind of warm still. Yeah, so there's her little sleep sack. Okay, what's in my last box? I should have some goodies for myself in this one, I think. I don't know. I could be totally mistaken. Come on, box. What is that? Oh, I forgot about that. I don't remember what I ordered. Amazon Prime, we get it in two days, as long as it's a Prime item. Okay, here we go. Here's an amazing baby swaddle sack. Size small, zero to three months. Yay. Six to 14 pounds, that's the one we need for now. Get this baby washed and eat it now. like expensive brands and they have cheaper brands like it's a sleep sack so I don't see a need in paying double for a certain brand like like kind of with neutral ones so after he outgrows them I could give them to someone that has a boy or a girl you know look how cute this one is it was white with gray elephants his little arms go up this looks huge though too because he's so tiny six to 14 pounds it's the same thing. You can just fold his little hands in there if you want. 
usually when he's sleeping, I don't know, sometimes his hands are down, sometimes they're up. So I don't know. We're going to have to see how he likes those things. Uh, next in here, I got these cups. <sighs> Alex has written through tops of some of her cups. So I'm trying to find ones that are... It says reinforced bite proof. And this is supposed to be still spill proof too, right? Leak proof. I don't know. I'm having issues with all of her cups. And first thing in the morning when she goes on for a nap, she has a bottle. I know it's terrible because she's already over two. But I needed cups that she could kind of lay down with. Like I rock her to sleep so she's not like laying flat. But I needed cups that will work with her kind of laying down. So I went with these. These are Munchkin Sippy Cups. This is for nine months and older, but it shows like a little toddler on there. Reinforced bite proof. Yeah, she bit one of the things. Oh, that has a hard thing in it. She can't bite it. Good, that's what we need. So I just got a two pack of these, blue and green. So they'll be fine for her and for Jackson when he gets bigger. So we can get today. I told her, I said, today's the last day for Baba's because you're a big girl. So I'm hoping these are really um, spill proof too. So she tosses it on the floor, which I'll tell her, you know, pick up your cup so it doesn't leak. And she usually does, but we'll have to try those out. See how those work for us. Also in this box, donut molds to make some keto donuts. A silicone donut mold. Nicole has got me like on this kick. So yeah, it's just a donut mold. That's it, silicone donut mold. Nothing special about it. I just found the cheapest one. And the last thing in here I'm really excited about, it's a ring light, but it's for like a desktop. It says, fill light and beauty face. Make face and eye and beauty. Night core extreme, multiple color temperatures. ordered the right one. There were multiple ones. I wanted the one that had the camera holder in the middle, like my big ring light that I'm using now. So, does this not have... What? So what, this doesn't have a hole for it to sit on, or what? Oh god. This is not the one I ordered. What the heck do you set it on? I'm so confused right now. So this has on off brightness up and down the co I don't think this is like what am I supposed to put it on and what the hell is this I'm so confused okay wait I don't even know what this is. There's no instructions. What is this? What the heck? This is, I don't think this is what I ordered whatsoever. So how's it? Here's to tilt it. This is all it came with. I thought I ordered one that had the camera holder that went through the middle. There's no instructions, no nothing. Okay, 
Okay. It says, the ring supplement lamp is suitable for selfie and live video streaming. It has the functions of fill light, beauty face, beauty eye, brightness, skin, etc. It can also adjust for three color temperatures and according to your favorite and according your favorite to adjust various shade, whatever that means, and is equipped with a variety of heights and angles in use with frame, which is a beauty weapon. What the hell does that even mean? Okay, so they have it up like this in the picture. What do you, you freaking put it on? Like, it's not even facing to where you can tilt it. This is not a stand. What the hell is it? <laughs> I literally don't even know how this works. see what this is. The rest of the stuff I'm perfectly fine with. Ow! This thing? Oh, I just bit my finger. I have no idea. Okay. So that's what holds your camera, I guess. What? I need to put it on a different... I guess you put it on your own tripod and then this holds your camera? I don't know. I think I'm figuring it out. And that's not going to be real sturdy. If you have a... It doesn't even stay on. What in God's name is this contraption? Okay, I stuck it through there and snipped it on. I don't know. So what, it's like that? Oh my god, I don't know. How's that supposed to hold my phone? Well, I guess it would hold my phone through there. Okay, I'm figuring it out now. It'd be nice if I had some freaking instructions. It'd be really nice. And then you just put it on a tripod. Okay, we'll have to try it out. I don't know, could be total fail. I'll have to let you know. But yeah, that's everything I picked up from Amazon that came in this shipment. We'll have to see how the cups work, see how this light works, see how that little baby carrier works. Try out my donut mold. And yeah. <laughs> Sorry if this was weird, but this thing totally threw me off. But now it's like, okay, it has it. But this doesn't even tighten. It's not even tightening up. But my phone would sit in here sideways if I wanted to film. It pivots on this thing, that little ball, which I guess is nice. You can just kind of tilt it wherever. And then this goes on a tripod. But that's, I don't have a tripod to put it on. Not a small one. That's what I was hoping. It, I thought it came with one. Anyway, thank you for watching this little Amazon haul. I'll have to check out these little settings and all this garbage. Hopefully I didn't waste my money. Anyway, that's it for this unboxing. I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys. <laughs>